Hi, this is Cecilia from Scrapbooking Cecilia and today I want to uh, show you the album that I made. Well, it's not exactly an album. I made the Black Interactive Folio album by Graphic 45 and life is abundant. I use the 8x8 the patterns and solids and the stamp set for making my folio and this will be my entrance to the opportunity to get a space again in graphic 45 design team so this is for a graphic 45 brand ambassador call 2425 okay so i know it's april right now but I don't mind because I want this for me and I actually have some memories from January, February, March and this April month that I am going to be including, of course, in my folio. And I really, really love it. I think this is just perfect to get your memory every month in just one place. So this is my cover and we have two spines this is smaller and this is my back cover originally the folio has a magnet here to close this up but because i was sure that this will be feel a lot and use it for a complete year that's why i added a closure extra closure because i added some elements that you'll see in a moment let me tell you about the cover this and this and this and this and here they all are from the sticker sheet which is in the 12 by 12 but i didn't use the papers none of those okay i made a frame here and then i have this a uh, piece of chipboard a uh, graphic 45 graph chip from black chipboard covered with this gorgeous paper I don't remember the months right now, but it's easy to work with this because I added the spaces for the 12 months of the year using for each month the paper that corresponds, okay? And with the leftovers, I use it to make this. This uh, is patterns and solids, but I stamp here in black and then with embossing powder, I added the stars. And I really love how this uh, frame looks now. Okay, <clears throat> let's move inside because there are a lot of things to see here. <laughs> so, in this flap where is the magnet, which is covered actually right now, I have a space for January. And this will be closing here with the magnet and you have space to journal. In here, you can add a small picture if you want or just decorate because the paper is so beautiful. I am not planning to have a lot of pictures, but I want to have some of them. Now, this is a picture mat and I cover it with a balloon and is stamped in the month on the top. Okay, and this you have more space to journal. So this will be here in the back as well as this <clears throat> and this this secure it and this gorgeous butterfly actually is a hidden pocket to put an extra picture mat here so you will learn in the tutorial that is going to be available the first chapter because I am not sure yet how many they are going to be because I want you to know all my tricks so it's going to be a little bit long but you will have time to see every chapter in my channel soon and here we have more room for January so I just made here this pocket this is one of the flaps that is included on the interactive folio and I use it to put it in this side and here I have more rooms for my February pictures 
let me move this a little bit to this side because I want to show you and I of course put my uh, month card because then you can make a mark of the day of each picture that you are journaling here and also if you want you can use it as a picture mat here so this is January January February and of course here we have more room okay I use two of the large uh, tags in black of course and here we have more February and when you remove this because I use magnets to hold it this is a spot to add a nice picture here of course and then we can secure it just with our magnets so let me find where is the other one here okay so this is for january <clears throat> let's open it this and i hope it's the most that i can on frame so now this is march and you have two of these uh, small uh, pockets as well and i added on my spines this is in the center well almost on the center and this is on the side and here of course i add this to add my pictures here let's see if i can put it back in my car april because the papers are so beautiful i also want to show up my papers i want to enjoy them every time that i am watching my pictures in my memorabilia or whatever i have to put here okay so here is april here is april and here is april as well as here we have this pocket to put pictures here let me show you because i think now let me show you here you can add your picture on the back and also here in the bottom i think that i need to move it there you go okay <clears throat> so now when we open this to the right we have here may and again i use my trick that i use it in the first uh, page again using some bellum and some of the stamping with embossing powders which look so beautiful the space for a picture here a space for journaling and here we have again room for add our pictures here and this will look amazing so this is may now we have june here and here and one more time we open this we open here and we have our picture mat here one of those of course because here we have again more room to add the pictures and this is open also but i should try it before there you go okay so now we can close here we can close here and we can close here and this piece is the long and biggest piece that you will find all of this so i decided to put this in the center and I just made this a uh, hinge with enough room because on the bottom I have one of my uh, waterfalls okay so here we have July now I added a magnet closure magnet magnet to closure here and I decided to use the top space for my picture 
and here in the bottom for journaling. This is still July. And here we'll start with August. And let me find, because we have here open to put anything we want. Here we will have August, again, August and August. I am not sure, no, this is closed. So we can close here in this flap. Now, September, and it's the same that we made here in March. We have one uh, of the regular tags. These are the regular tags, and this is the back. So I think that now I need to move this a little bit to this side. Well, December, I want it in the top. So this is the second one. And I changed my hinge again here because I wanted to have more room. And because here we will have October, November, and then December in this flap, that's why I did it in this way. And even to have enough room here, I added an extra spaces with these two flaps and again here it is open this is october and here it's also for october and here you can see we have that gorgeous images and now we have here november November and November and this is removable okay so as you can see here this only closes uh, open to this point but I don't mind because I want to see we will have the opportunity of see the picture standing up in this way but if you want to try this I have to warn you that because of these two flaps now there is more bulkiness here and that's the reason why my uh, folio doesn't close completely it's a little bit uh, <laughs> fatty and you can skip that part if you want and this is finally december the last uh, month of the year so and we have again here another huge tag and this will be closing in this way this flap is going first then this and this here and you can see here we have this because i added more spaces to make this but it works for me in the tutorial you will see it as i told you in a few days if you are not subscribed uh, to my channel yet and you want to try this, maybe you want to consider subscribing and be uh, waiting until the first chapter is uploaded here. If you click on the little bell, you not, uh, YouTube will notify you when I get ready the first in every video that I have new in my channel so i hope you like it and i hope to be another year with graphic 45 because i really enjoy so much working with the beautiful papers and all the products that they have and stay tuned the next video with the tutorial will be here soon and also another thing i added the year which is 2024 because I always like to add uh, details like those because eventually we won't remember anything. <laughs> so I want to be able and know which year was this made and which year pictures are inside. So thank you so much.